positive end expiratory pressure is the pressure in the lungs above atmospheric pressure that exists at the end of expiration. The two types of PEEP are extrinsic PEEP and intrinsic PEEP. Pressure that is applied or increased during an inspiration is termed pressure support. Intrinsic PEEP, auto PEEP a euro incomplete expiration prior to the initiation of the next breath causes progressive air trapping. This accumulation of air increases alveolar pressure at the end of expiration, which is referred to as auto PEEP. Auto PEEP develops commonly in high minute ventilation, expiratory flow limitation and expiratory resistance. Once auto PEEP is identified, steps should be taken to stop or reduce the pressure buildup. When auto PEEP persists despite management of its underlying cause, applied PEEP may be helpful if the patient has an expiratory flow limitation. Extrinsic PEEP Applied PEEP a euro is usually one of the first ventilator settings chosen when mechanical ventilation is initiated. It is set directly on the ventilator. A small amount of applied PEEP is used in most mechanically ventilated patients to mitigate end expiratory alveolar collapse. A higher level of applied PEEP is sometimes used to improve hypoxemia or reduce ventilator associated lung injury in patients with acute lung injury, acute respiratory distress syndrome or other types of hypoxemic respiratory failure. Equals complications equals, positive end expiratory pressure can contribute to, decrease in systemic venous return, pulmonary barotrauma can be caused. Pulmonary barotrauma is lung injury that results from the hyperinflation of alveoli past the rupture point. The effects of PEEP on intracranial pressure have been studied. Although PEEP is hypothesized to increase ICP due to impedance of cerebral blood flow, it has been shown that high PEEP does not increase ICP. Renal functions and electrolyte imbalances, due to decreased venous return metabolism of certain drugs are altered and acid-base balance is impeded. History, John Scott Inkster an English anesthetist and physician is credited with discovering PEEP. See also, positive pressure ventilation, positive airway pressure. References External links